It's a fantastic Scottish, fantastic Scottish burger. Hi there, I'm Sam Hewan here in Scotland and we're going to create the most perfect Scottish burger for you guys to enjoy for my foods. I'm Jason Waddleton from The Haven in Boston. I mean, to be honest, for me, the burger, uh, it's, it's never a burger without actually the fries. I do want that little element of bacon on there. It gives that salt in us, it gives that little bit of texture as well. I mean, I guess anything dessert, you know, anything that's like too sweet. Never have pineapple on a pizza. Let's keep it off the burger too. To be honest, I'd rather not share my burger. Um, I'd like to share the same table with someone. They have their own burger. I think probably my co-star on, um, on our, my TV show, Outlander, you know. It's a tough one because there's a list of ladies I'd love to have a burger with, but as soon as you pick the burger up, the focus is all on the burger, so they're forgotten. It's a messy business. Uh, it's probably not a first date food, is it? I'll go for a, a good company, Billy Connolly. I'm from, obviously here in Scotland, and you're in, I believe, in Boston, in America. Indeed, yeah, we're uh, we're coping with things in Boston quite well here. You look like you're well stocked up there, obviously in the back bar. Um, but we're not here to talk alcohol. We're here to talk about burger and. Uh, well, let's, let's create the, the most spectacular burger that's obviously going to win this competition. Um, you're obviously from, from Scotland originally, and myself and Obini from Scotland. Um, I think it's about time that we brought the, we brought the Mac, the Mac burger back to Scotland and, and gave it that little twist. So, um, yeah, do you have any ideas how we're going we're gonna to win this challenge? Well, I, I think we could start off with uh, what, what type of meat would we want to use? You know, currently we have a fantastic burger at the Haven. Obviously it's beef. You know, I actually was born and raised a vegetarian, which uh, may be a shock to some people, but the first time I ever had a burger actually was in America. I was 24 years old. It was it was about this big, juicy, delicious beef. Um, you know, we have very, very good Scotch beef in, in Scotland. So, you know, for a treat, I like to eat you know now and then, and I think you know let's go let's go with a classic. Yeah, we can we can get hold of great beef over here. I know most uh, most Scottish cuisine is is normally deep fried. You know we love uh, we love deep fried Mars bars. We love deep fried pizza. I don't think we should deep fry this burger in its entirety, but um, yeah, definitely uh, definitely want to make it succulent and hearty. You know, a good Scottish meal. What do you think about onions? I know that you've got a, 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 your own whiskey at the moment, which I have uh, I know about, the Sassanac. Well, I was thinking would, we could come up with some, I like it. Maybe we could get some onions and caramelize them. Whiskey, oh. caramelized onions could be a shout. Now you're talking my language. Whiskey, caramelized onions, that sounds absolutely delicious. With the bacon element in there, perhaps, we could do a bacon onion marmalade, caramelized. I'm salivating already. What kind of cheeses do you have? I do like I do like a huntsman cheese. You've got the you've oh. got a, a cheddar almond in that. You've also got a little bit. You know, it's the wheel and the middle third is is um is it like a Stilton blue cheese? I, can't, I wish I could try. It. I took an older one now, but um, okay. So we've, we've got that, and I guess what about the bun? I mean, that's always important, isn't it? What, what are we? Uh... Currently, we use a. It's actually a milk bun, and it is real. What's nice about that? is it retains moisture when it's cooked. And so it's nice and fluffy. That keeps all of that, you know, that, that juice and the succulent, the, you know, the, the stuff in the meat and obviously the caramelized onions and, and the whiskey. You want to capture that. Um, I love that. Yeah. Obviously being Scottish, we don't want to waste anything. You know, we're, we're, we're very... Uh, we're <laughs> wasted. Yeah. Google, um, this, this, is, this, is sounding, this is sounding perfect. I guess all we need really then is a name. You got any ideas there? But I was thinking, what about, my, obviously my name's Hugh, and I was thinking, what about the Hugh Jim? That's good. I was almost on, I was looking at Hugh and Cry and Hugh and something, the band from the 80s, and I, obviously with your name. Hugh, the Jacobite? The Jacobite. Scottish, Scottish burger, I think you, uh, you hit it there, especially with the whiskey, uh, the whiskey onions, I think that's amazing. Probably need something to cut it with. I brought, I brought the right, implement you need a big a big knife just to cut it up and i like that i need a whiskey now i'm gonna have one oh let's have a whiskey as well well done okay. 
She has some, uh, the Jacobite vodka. This is the Jacobite. I think it's some classic sure. frontline foods, and I think this is a great, a great way to support, um, you know, local businesses and, and also you know, yeah. key work. So, uh, cheers to that, Slanja, and, and I look forward to trying the Jacobite. Nice one, son. Cheers, mate.